but I'll be showing you how to go through the coastal cave and dealing with the bosses there and getting you to the first shrine of Dragon Communion. So what you're going to want to do is start here at the Church of Ella. You're going to ride down here, like headed back this way. What you're going to want to do is basically advance down in order to get to the coastal cave. The coastal cave is sitting on the cliff side, so you'll have to make your way down. Um, you can get down however you want to get down. It's up to you, really. You can ignore the giant or the troll if you want. Get down here on the beach. You can explore if you want. It's up to you, dog. right around these little beastmen here. Head on in. Do your little light if you want to do your light. Activate your grace. Activate your summoning pool. So if you're in the grave you want to give somebody a hand, you can use your golden effigy. So go ahead and start heading down through the cave. There are going to be people on some ledges. Deal with them. Ignore them. You know, that's, that's really up to you. Now, you can drop down and get closer immediately. Or you can go around the side and deal with the extra little... Gather up some cave moss. More down here on the bottom. This is where we could have dropped down. Chad, no, I'll, I'll go ahead. So, okay, so my best bet, my, or my best advice is usually the guy does not, the other, there's going to be two bosses here. It's going to be like two of those feral beasts with, there it is, there's one. So there's going to be two of those. Um, initially, I had a bit of trouble fighting these guys, but you can parry these guys fairly easy. They're fairly easy to read. Um, I would take the one that is sleeping over here first, or laying down. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna raise my level a bit. Don't judge me. climbing up and you'll find yourself on the other side of the beach so make your way up however you want you can take torrent I'll give you a leg I'll give you a leg 
continue to make your way up. Activate your grace. Now I don't know if I'm gonna have anything. Last time I did my playthrough it doesn't have anything initially, so you can examine the altar. Probably won't be able to do anything initially because you actually have to start killing dragons to start getting their powers and stuff like that. So, you know, just come over here. So, as a recap, you want to head to the coastal cave. If you head southwest onto the beach area, make your way down. Follow through. You'll head to the coastal cave. Inside, you'll deal with the two barrel beastmen. They're not too, too tough, especially if you come back here a little bit later and found it. And inevitably, it'll take you out towards the Shrine of Dragon Communion, or Church of Dragon Communion. And you'll be able to spend um, your dragon horse and stuff like that. But be, be in mind, when you start a new game, it's not going to have like all of them just sitting there for every dragon you've beaten. So you have to actually slay a couple dragons, so and so. So... That's that. I'm gonna be making another one here in a couple minutes. We'll do Stormfoot Catacombs. I know these are simple, but you know, for people starting out, this is important that you know if they want a guide to go off, if they can go off a guide. Um, like I said, make sure you explore around the area a little bit. Grab whatever you want. There might be a beetle here somewhere. I'm not completely sure. I'll see you in the next one, guys.